Welcome to the Ready Persona One vlog number seven. Yo, I gotta well, talk about. This. I gotta talk about something. <laughs> so this is something I've been like dying to talk about. Um, mm -hmm. All right. I just wanna. This is totally like a character moment for me. Just the the welling on um, Nave. Yeah. In mm -hmm. my in my head, it's a complete parallel of Dennis welling on Cade when he was a kid. Like, yeah, there's a movie there as I'm throwing kicks on the on you while you're laying on the ground. It would flash back to that really quick. Mm. Like, okay. Oh, interesting. I didn't think about that yet. That's that's cool. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, you... Oh man. Yeah. I mean, I I guess we will have confessionals that we have not yet recorded. Right. Not only this one, but the last session as well. Right. Um, and I'm not sure what you guys are going to put in your confessionals. I have a list. <laughs> no. I do too. Um, man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but this session, oh, a doozy. Um, you guys got weaknesses that are permanent now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That'll be fun. It will be. <laughs> more than the weakness i'm just uh, mind blown that she uh knew yeah that's what's crazy why how that's yeah. a good question how did she know why did she know i have a theory i have a theory about that but uh, I, I, I think i think her mom told her because mm -hmm. she knew mm -hmm. that makes sense and, and then she told her children because she also but they also know that we are like in the beta testing because we told them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it's kind of you can put us. Yeah. You see, like Gabe has always three minions around him, so you can put one and two together. I think. And then. But how does the mom? She, she's a smart one, though. Because yeah. um, Gabe told Gabe her. told her mm -hmm. specifically that, that I'm Kate. Yes. She yeah. said uh, the Chrono Killer. He said the yeah, Chrono I think killer. that episode just came out. It just came out. Us. Yeah, yeah, so he told, Where... he told her because she, she recognized the... you, kind of, and then Gabe. Because I know she, her. I know she told like I'm living with a serial killer, but I didn't realize that, she, you know that. And I, Chrono. Drew, and I think with the Chrono G killer. Yeah, and did that? And did that? <laughs> and did that uh, I I remember that we were talking about which jacket you put the bug on, and I don't know if he, if if uh, Gabe was necessarily wearing the same jacket at don't the think Titanic. He, was. Was it, he nope. wasn't because was it was it was actually a suit, which he, was, okay. yeah. he, so that, he doesn't like wearing. So. Right. So that conversation, is this, there was a conversation between him and his wife at the Titanic. Mm -hmm. They had a really long conversation. And when she was just talking about like, why you have, you already have a serial killer, mm -hmm. you already have blah, blah. Um, that part was not a conversation that Cade had heard then since right. he wasn't wearing that coat. So, so I don't know if Cade necessarily knows that the wife knows. Mm -hmm. So, so that makes makes, it, makes things like, very interesting. Okay. Uh, um, we were looking at like the number of votes, and we found some fun, interesting things. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we did. So, um, you want to go? Even? So, some people voted for themselves, which I thought was interesting. Yeah. Voted to mm -hmm. vote themselves off. So, mm. um, cool I won't get to make a professional cool about it because it doesn't happen, but. If it would have been me and um, Captain Crunch, I would have done this. I would have voted myself. Mm -hmm. um, that was Captain something Crunch. that was a very specific scenario. Captain but Crunch thought otherwise. I, I think yeah. of all of the. I think of all of the characters. Like if all Yellow wanted to do was to have fun, I think she's probably having the most fun out of everyone. Because not only is she safe on the island. Mm -hmm. um, she gets to watch all this trauma unfold now in front of her. <laughs> oh boy! I mean, it was fun up until the point where uh, they got voted off. Mm -hmm. And he died. That was where ocean. the fun ended. Where now I cannot protect him. Mm. Mm. That is where the fun is gone. That yeah. actually leads me to like a general question to all of you: What was your character's primary motivation through this event? Hang out with his kids, but if it came down to it, as you saw. He wants his kids to win, so yeah, this is why he voted himself off. But his kids right. all voted for each other, right. so that's why I was happy when like the random vote hit game. But oh, oh, did I was like, yes, this this was his plan. Yeah, for for Nave, this this entire event is just checkers, and he's playing chess. 
<laughs> he's totally using it to to manipulate Loki in the long yes. Run. <laughs> he doesn't care any. He doesn't care at all about I've got, yeah. about that game. Yeah, but, yeah. Right. Even I was his whole thing play... was all about trying to manipulate things. Same. <laughs> and it's funny that this it's the same character kind of that ruined one of his plans. It's that damn Captain Crunch again and his stupid squirrel. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that stupid like, squirrel. <laughs> his whole the whole thing, the whole voting thing was so. Nave expected that Homeboy would be dropped off immediately as yeah. soon as he was with the family. So he himself thought, "But I need, I want to get as soon as possible to the <laughs> island to have this conversation with Homeboy mm. without anyone else." This is mm-hmm. the perfect moment. There are not that many people there. Yeah. And then suddenly Yellow gets voted up. I'm like, wait a minute. I'm going to count. And he's counting the votes and it doesn't make sense. <laughs> so that's why he asked, like, Yellow, did you vote for yourself? And he's pretty sure he didn't vote for himself. So that leaves only one option. Mr. Crunchy. Mm-hmm. Crunched it. Mm-hmm. So that was really interesting. And that, that blew my mind. Like, what? Yeah, yeah. I was super curious about that, too. Like, hmm why did Captain Crunch vote yellow? Could we ask that question? You can ask you... that question. Why Why do you think Captain Crunch did that in the moment? I think once he had gotten a, a moment with yellow, at that point, he wanted to just stay in character. And just mm. at that point, be in more Captain Crunch's mindset to just to just like play to win. And I think <laughs> he felt that... Um, I think he was just he's taking a gamble between you know what would be the best way for him to f- get win at the end because i think he knows how clever yellow is as a character he knows that the mm-hmm. yellow character is clever and more ca- more clever than captain crunch so i think it's just he just is trying to stay in character at that point and just do what captain crunch would do and not necessarily what nathaniel bosk would do um and to be but, fair he's playing it really well yeah yeah <laughs> captain crunch is one of the best scenarios right now the yeah best, the best posi- positions to have it's crazy he doesn't <laughs> have a terrible weakness or nope. at least one that's not in completely permanent um i mean yeah, he he does, yeah he's been under the radar the interesting mm-hmm. thing is is it's actually a perfect combination that he allows himself to be on the radar and he allows nutmeg to be front and center mm-hmm. and that's like perfect because yeah you want the cute little squirrel mm-hmm. to be front and center and then you want the person that's you know attached to him to sort of just be in the on the sidelines and then mm-hmm. it to actually play is... off of that point um i i mean i th- i think it's fairly obvious and to answer the question from earlier what your character's motivation was um yellow as a character um wants to have fun but for rest as a character wants nathaniel to win Mm. so that's the dual mindset there Mm. and it's extremely obvious that yellow has been creating a lot of chaos and just doing Mm -hmm. crazy stuff and i didn't actually expect to be voted off this one i expected to be voted off next time um but then i would have gotten a weakness but then you would have gotten a weakness so (laughs) maybe you should thank captain crunch (laughs) thank you expected to get voted off on that captain crunch vote you did or you Mm -hmm. did not did fully Mm -hmm. expected to get voted off As for K was... <laughs> and his motivations in this one, or uh, Chrono, I think that he's, okay, so he's associating winning this tournament as this is going to prove I'm a hero. Mm-hmm. But he's very ah. ego attached to winning, and I like the dynamic where he's doing very unheroic things, trying to prove he's a hero by winning this. And that's where yeah. He is. yeah, I like that. It's going to be some really interesting resolutions after this i think i think that um it will probably be explicitly told to him um by the council what they (laughs) think about his performance throughout this throughout this so i don't know if that'll be a good reality check for him or if he's just going to be like oh they're crazy like they don't know what they're talking about i don't know Mm -hmm. what what he'll think about that if my theory is correct then there's another reality check that he's gonna face (laughs) because <laughs> i have a, i have there's a there's a one of the the, the 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 hero characters who we don't know yet who plays that character i'm like 
almost 99 percent sure after this. I, I've, I've been Ooh, dropping this. some hints. I've been dropping yeah, a lot of hints. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and, and yeah, I'm locking that one down in my head. I'm, I'm not not wanting to spoil stuff for, yeah, for yeah, viewers yeah. and that kind of stuff. But I have yeah. one that I'm 100 percent locking down right now. Yeah, I have it narrowed down to two people, mm-hmm. and it was all because of that first question that we asked you about Apple do, or not Apple do. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, yeah. yeah, the dentist lady. Yeah. Who, for most of the part, we have at least um, I have believed may have been Apple Do. Mm-hmm. Um, I, I mean, the my first, my very first instinct for whatever reason was to latch on to like, oh, maybe that's Viridian. Mm-hmm. And then I kind of wrote it off as like, no, it's mm-hmm. not happening. And then when you said you really want to get into Yellow's head, I was like, maybe? Mm-hmm. It's either yellow or, or Verdian or Apple do. Mm-hmm. I thought it was Abe's wife. I thought. Uh, yeah, that's that's something that I was like, oh, man, that would have been fun. To Ariel. Learn. Mm-hmm. But then I remembered, I don't absolutely know, first off, who Apple do is married to. It'd be an actually... int- that definitely would be an interesting twist if Ariel mm-hmm. was playing <laughs> since that was essentially what caused her marriage to fall apart the game caused her marriage to fall apart so it'd be interesting mm-hmm. if she turned around and started playing in the game that would be an interesting twist yeah because yeah, yeah just... she asked odin about or is there an all mother or whatever whatever mm-hmm. the mm-hmm. the thing was and mm-hmm. then i also remember like viridian uh i mean they when we haven't seen a lot of viridian screen time um, but the very few scenes we've seen is just her flirting with Kate. <laughs> so I'm wondering if that's just part of her character that you've kind of put which, into it. It's like, she's sorry, just a which, huge flirt. You're talking about Root Canal? Yeah, Root Canal. Mm-hmm. If Root Canal is Appledew or Viridian. Mm-hmm. Um, and maybe I'm just going off onto a huge tangent and it's neither of those two. And then it's like, oh. Um, but there's just too many factors, and I I keep forgetting to write notes. It's because... Stalin steel. <laughs> <laughs> How awesome would it be if it's Stalin yeah. steel? <laughs> hey, it, it could be like some could fat old steel, man. For all yeah, you know. it's the internet. Who knows? It's the internet. Who knows? Jack's Who dad. For me, I feel like <laughs> Doctor Pimper is just the shoe, and I'm just you know, it's the shoe that's waiting to drop. No, Dr. Kemper's yeah. emoji. He's mm-hmm. <laughs> the would... emoji. <laughs> yeah. Emoji's Apple dude. You're laughing, but it could totally be he's keeping an eye on us 24 7 mm-hmm. with that emoji. I'm, I'm, well, that is a very real possibility. I also I'm... know that <laughs> Hark said in like one or two episodes ago, like some of this stuff I've just kind of been repping off of you guys. Yeah. Um, so I'm wondering if he doesn't even know and he's just being like, what would be the most interesting thing to do to these guys? How can I screw with them? You know, <laughs> <laughs> I one thing I will say is that there are two characters whose identity I had swapped around once or twice, actually, since the session zero. I swapped mm. them since session zero because of stuff that happened during the campaign. Um, and I was very mm-hmm. careful to reassign those things um, to uh, maintaining the maintaining that it would still make sense. Mm-hmm. It was them. So I, I have the, the people who are those characters. Uh, yes, were not who I initially assigned them to. I, that is true. Oh, what? Um, Moji and uh, I, I'm not I'm not going to specify who, but oh, okay. no, no. Mm-hmm. but yeah. I'm not going to specify who. All right. <laughs> not going to specify whether to tease us like that. Yeah. You can ask me later after all of them have been revealed. You can ask me then <laughs> during the vlog. Mm-hmm. Have any been revealed yet or switched around? How about that? Or I, I feel guess like that would give away too much. None of them were. That would give away give too away. much. I can't answer that question without giving it okay. away. Hmm. Um. One thing I also wanted to point out is that I I seriously considered 
making this whole event darker, as in like Squid Game darker. I seriously consider that. But <laughs> I decided to keep it more lighthearted just to contrast what's happening in the real world right now. Because you're real where you're dealing with like a murder and you're dealing yeah. with. <laughs> so I, I didn't want it. I, I wanted there to be like these different shifting tones. Um, mm-hmm. And also because, well, I don't want to say anything, but yeah. there's... I, there, there is a strategic reason why I decided to not go the Squid Game route for this, but I'm hopefully mm-hmm. it's still entertaining for you all. I'm because still... there's going to be a Squid Game later. <laughs> there's going to be a Squid Game later. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like the first one was really competitive, and it was like very crunchy. We want to win, and then the others were so entertaining. Like we could, yeah. we made shows, we made potions. It was so fun, <laughs> just in an entertaining level. Really yeah. like them. I apologize if people were hoping for more dice rolls in the other events. And again, that was only because I wanted to pack a lot of things. And uh, I figured if I did, if I designed the events that the way that they were, I front loaded the first event as that's the big dice roll event. And then the next mm-hmm. ones to be ones we can just fly through mm-hmm. to save time. That That's why I did that. And then I the last one, that. the last one I'm <laughs> hoping is, is going to be entertaining because you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Why wouldn't you want Leonard? Why wouldn't you want to convince Leonard Leonard from accounting to be your arch nemesis? Oh. <laughs> oh, was Leonard from accounting? Le- Leonard the accounting. I, I again, I, I apologize. I'm making all these Marvel references, but I don't know if you ever saw the shorts of Thor with his roommate. He has this roommate. I forgot. Oh, his name. I have not um, thought about that in a long time. I'll, I'll try to send it to you just so you can sort mm-hmm. of go how I. So you can get an idea of what I'm picturing Leonard to be like, but Thor, he, as in Chris Hemsworth, like he ends up rooming with this just a normal random guy. He just starts yeah. living with him and then shenanigans happens when <laughs> he's living with this guy. So I'll, I'll send that to you. Uh, but And everybody watching should watch it too. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh. We also found That's... out that Gabe's not oh, Gabe's kids or Odin's uh, kids also all have something going on. They've got something going on. Loki seems yeah. to be writing love letters and stuff's going on with Thor. Oh. Thor's not as straightforward as we thought. Mm-hmm. Oh, Would it be illegal uh, in this context? Like we're in a, a, a TV show reality thing. If, if it came out to like um, live stream, and I'm not sure if it has or not. But if it came out to live stream that she was using, would, it, would drugs, she be disqualified? Yeah. Probably. 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 Okay. And they didn't screen us before entering. <laughs> like, okay. Beating We're up. heroes. To be I, fair, it's your heroes. Being or, it's being organized by live. What can happen to us? So, <laughs> well, Jacob Steele. <laughs> li- live stream's not not organizing it. He he's just, just oh, okay. He's not, he doesn't really have a any narrator. Mm-hmm. You're right. He's just there to yeah. narrate. Yes. So. Uh, I'm, I'm just trying to think of who, who, who it is. Because huh? like is? for uh, Loki, the person Loki likes. Mm-hmm. Oh, no, yeah. Because someone, no someone he, he doesn't even want like Odin to find out. And I was like, ah. Oh, um, I'm assuming it is a character that we have met. And it, it, this is like an in universe. If it's assuming that it's a character we have met and it is in the game, um, there are not many options. I will. But if, con- go ahead. Huh? But if it's not like, if it's not Loki's love, for example, and it's and it's actually, um, oh wow, I've forgotten your son's Raphael's name. Raphael's Raphael. love. Um, then there's a a whole wider picture. I, I will confirm that it is a character you have met. You have already met that character. Yes. Mm-hmm. But well, if it's a character in the game, or is it like Ra- Raphael's love necessarily? That I will not know. answer yet. Okay. That I will not answer yet. He goes, we'll see. This is a letter to myself. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Well, to be fair, it's 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 quite easy to find out. Just go to Raphael and ask. He can't lie. <laughs> he's co- oh, he can lie, but he's com- he's he's, he's mm-hmm. having a hard time to lie. Having a hard time, no. Oh. Yeah. Um. Because yeah, there's only like two or three options, right? I'm um, if you count uh yellow as a girl, 
which I mean, her physical gender is a her, mm. uh, but they consider themselves they. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, and then you have Apple Do. Yeah. Or not Apple. It's <laughs> I'm associating um, Tooth. Uh, what's her name? I keep forgetting her name. The, uh, the dentist. Jennifer Steele. Oh, Root Canal. Root, root Canal. Thank you. Oh, oh you're, okay. you're talking about the. Yeah. Oh, 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 if, oh if I, see, I see. I see. If it's contained within the game, which there are not a lot of options, and yeah. he did mention it was a girl. I mean, unless it's nutmeg <laughs> again. It's forbidden love. Yeah, forbidden <laughs> love. Mm-hmm. Um, that's why I don't really see it as being something that's contained to that world. It might be Raphael's actual crush. I think so. I think it's outside, but yeah, we'll see. I'm curious to find out. Okay. Dave has to talk to his kids. <laughs> <laughs> but oh, Dave doesn't know about it yet. I know, yeah. I know. Mm-hmm. Dave what if know about it. are are those? I I you won't answer that question if it's. I was <laughs> going to ask the question: Are those? Are the? Is it like the drugs and the? I mean, if the love letter is, then the drugs might be like real world problem too. But you're not going to answer that question because mm-hmm. why would you? Oh dear, that's it could be. This session was fun, guys. <laughs> mm-hmm. Hey, and everyone that voted out are now having a luau on the beach. That's true. I, I think for or not for us, uh, Yellow would like have food and then go off on their own. I think that's what would happen. Nah, Odin's trying to get all the losers and just be like, that's a fun. Woo. Nice. Actually, do we know what's going on? Is there like a big TV screen that we're watching or something? Or You're, do we just like passively? You know? are watching. It, it's like Big Brother. It's like Survivor. Mm-hmm. Brother. So you are watching all the events. You are watching. Um, I, there's question right now whether or not uh, the stuff on the roof was captured or not. I haven't mm-hmm. figured that out yet, but certainly everything within the house you witnessed. So specific things that happened in the house you witnessed. And with that... Well, oh, oh! It looks like looks like uh, the uh, we the uh, rest of the group is not going to see the reveal of the costumes. Yes, I'm ready. Do you want to show Ethan your costumes? Oh no! <laughs> I don't know what it is, so I'll record my. I'm ready. Whenever you're ready. <laughs> oh that, wow, that's so cute! Come here, I'm gonna... oh my goodness! <laughs> Oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Is that Grouch, Three. Count Chocula, yeah. oh, or not Tra- that's Dracula? That's so cute. Elmo. <laughs> I love it. We need to take a picture. Yeah, yeah. that's what we do need. All right. right. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Stay for the hair. Take the count. Oh, one. I told you. Three. <laughs> while I get a uh, oh, blue. Oh, oh, look, at the, look at her suit. <laughs> look at her. It's purple. Oh, it's so cute. All right. Oh, well, Ethan, thank you so much for staying over. I'm glad that you enjoyed the after show. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Oh, do you have a matching one then? I do. I don't know what character. What's my character? Oh, here's my costume. It's Look. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. I'll put that on. Okay, I'll put it on.